Imagine a time when Europe, as we know it today, didn't exist. A time of vast, wild landscapes and nomadic tribes, this is a journey back to the cradle of a continent, where the seeds of civilization first took root. Here in untamed wilderness, roam tribes of hunter-gatherers, the first Europeans, eking out a living against the elements. These early inhabitants knew nothing of Europe. They were simply survivors, bound by the common struggle of existence. Yet, they laid the foundations of what we now recognize as Europe. Over time these nomadic tribes began to settle, drawn to the fertile river valleys. This marked the dawn of the first civilizations, where the pillars of society, culture and governance began to form. Fast forward through millennia, and these modest beginnings would evolve into kingdoms, empires, and nations. This was the birth of Europe, a continent that would go on to shape the course of world history. Europe has always been a stage for the rise and fall of great empires. First, the Roman Empire with its grandeur and might, stretched from the British Isles to the Middle East. Its legal systems, architectural innovations and social structures deeply influenced Western civilization. Then came the Byzantine Empire, the eastern fragment of the Roman Empire. This empire was a beacon of art, literature and Orthodox Christianity, serving as a bridge between the West and the East. And who can forget the Holy Roman Empire, a complex confederation of territories in Central Europe. It wasn't Roman, holy, nor an empire as Voltaire famously quipped, but it played a crucial role in shaping Europe's political landscape and promoting cultural and intellectual growth. These empires with their rise and fall painted the canvas of Europe's history. They shaped its culture, politics and society in unimaginable ways. These empires left their mark on Europe and their legacy can still be seen today. Europe was not just about wars and empires, it was also the cradle of discovery and enlightenment. As the Middle Ages faded, Europe embarked on an incredible journey known as the Age of Discovery. Mariners like Christopher Columbus, Vasco da Gama and Ferdinand Magellan braved uncharted seas, opening new trade routes and discovering lands unknown to the Europeans. This was a time of daring exploits and world-changing discoveries. Simultaneously, the Enlightenment was ushering in a new era of thought. European minds were challenging traditional views and questioning the world around them. Philosophers like Voltaire and Rousseau were advocating for human rights and democratic ideals, while scientists like Isaac Newton and Galileo Galilei were unraveling the mysteries of the universe. They collectively sparked a revolution in thinking, transforming society, and setting the stage for the modern world. This was a time when Europe was leading the world in exploration, science, and thought. The 20th century was a time of great turmoil for Europe, marked by two devastating world wars. Our journey through Europe's history leads us now to the heart-rending era of the First and Second World Wars, two cataclysmic events that originated in this very continent. The First World War, often called the Great War, erupted in 1914, pulling nations into a vortex of violence and conflict like never before. Its aftermath left political, economic and social scars across Europe paving the way for an even more destructive conflict. Hardly two decades later the Second World War broke out, plunging the world into a deeper abyss of violence. This war was marked by unprecedented atrocities, including the Holocaust, and led to a profound reshaping of Europe's political and physical landscape. The devastation wrought by these wars was unparalleled, leading to a massive loss of life and colossal destruction. These wars changed Europe and the world forever. In the aftermath of the world wars, Europe has emerged as a beacon of peace and unity. The ashes of conflict gave birth to a new era marked by cooperation and shared prosperity. This was largely facilitated by the formation of the European Union in the mid-20th century. The EU, with its 27 member nations, epitomizes the spirit of unity, working together to promote economic growth, maintain peace, and uphold democratic values. The fall of the Berlin Wall in 1989 further symbolized the end of division and the start of a new chapter. This momentous event signified the collapse of the Iron Curtain, paving the way for the reunification of Germany and marking the end of the Cold War in Europe. Today, Europe stands as a testament to its rich and varied history, a history that continues to shape the world. In spite of its past trials and tribulations, Europe has emerged stronger, fostering an era of unprecedented peace and unity. It's a story of resilience, a story that continues to unfold.